श्री भगवान उवाच काम्याम कर्मणा न्यासम सन्यासम कवि विदु सर्वकर्म फल त्यागम प्राहुर त्यागम विचक्षण हेलो फ्रेंड्स फ्रेंड्स दिस इज दी सेकंड श्लोक ऑफ द एटीन चैप्टर ऑफ भगवदगीता एंड टुडे वी विल अंडरस्टैंड दिस श्लोक इन डिटेल सो लेट्स फर्स्ट गोवर इट्स मीनिंग्स ऑफ द श्लोक सेज श्री भगवान उवाच विच मीन्स श्री कृष्णा सेड काम्याना कर्माण न्यासम विच मीन्स ड्रॉपिंग ऑफ डिजायर इन एक्शन सन्यासम कवियो विदु विच मीन्स दी लर्नड नो टू बी सन्यास सर्व कर्म फल त्यागम प्राहुस विच मीन्स दी रेनसिएशन ऑफ द फ्रूट्स ऑफ ऑल एक्शन इज कॉल्ड त्यागम विचक्षण विच मीन्स त्याग बाय दी ब्रिलियंट सो श्री कृष्ण नाउ बिगेन टू डिस्क्राइब टू अर्जुन the difference between sanyas and tyag and he basically says that uh, sanyas is uh, the renunciation of action while uh, uh, tyag is the renunciation of desire so he says that sanyas is uh, uh, something which involves dropping the desire to act while uh, tyag is uh, renunciation of desire which basically means renunciation of the fruits of all actions that one is performing so there is a very subtle difference between the two in that one means that uh, people basically will not act in itself dropping the act action itself while the other means not desiring the fruits of the uh, fruits of the actions basically so we can understand this from the example of food so in general we know that the food which uh, tastes not very good is something which is good for our health while uh, the taste food which is uh, not good for our health is the one which tastes good so in this way you know a sanyasi will say that you know i am dropping all actions and so he might then go after not eating any food at all while the tyagi the person who is performing tyag he basically will say that uh, i don't really care about the taste of the food the food taking food in itself is not a, not a problem for me i just don't care about the taste of the food so in that way a sanyasi because he has dropped the whole food eating the process of, he has dropped the process of eating the food in itself so he might harm himself while uh, the person who has performed tyag the tyagi he basically will not harm himself but instead would consume a food which is good for him because he doesn't care about the taste in itself so from this we can see the subtle difference between the two one is basically dropping of action itself and in the other one is basically dropping the fruit of the actions so uh, while thinking of uh, renunciation we have to think about the difference between these two one is to just renounce the action itself and the other one is to renounce the fruit of the action while still performing the action so that was the message of this shlok i hope that i have explained this shlok well to you with that i'll close this video i'll see you in the next video take care